Okay, this is the uh, power plant as it exists today. It's the last phase of development uh, for the farm here. And uh, I'll be showing you inside. It's actually in operation right now. And if we zoom in on that side, it says Paul Proctor's Power Plant, 1979. This must have been when this one got was first operated. So I think I'll show you the pipes that are coming down the hill that uh, go in and then we'll go inside and, and uh, show you how it all operates inside. Inside, uh, we have two water wheels, so they're bringing uh, two pipes down into the uh, power plant here. And if you listen there, you can actually hear the water flowing through. Okay, so we'll go in and take a look at that. Okay, I hope you can hear me, but uh, this is the uh, two pipes inside the power plant with uh, the two large gate valves. And then right there, you'll see another pipe leading off, which I'll making. I'll show you what that's operating here after we take a little bit of tour around the uh, power plant. So we have two pipes coming in here.
over over here. And you can see the two water wheels again a little better there. I was looking on the uh, data sheet there on that uh, alternator, and it says it's a hundred kilowatt alternator. And I'll just move up here as far as the gig uh, valve again. on the wall where the uh, basic panels are there, showing current, voltage, etc. So that's all there is to it, just having a water supply, water wheel, turning an alternator 24 hours a day since 1979. That's getting on to uh, 50 years this has been operating in this building here. We use all, lots of electricity on the farm here, but a lot of electricity goes to another organization uh, up on top of the hill there. And uh, somebody supplied a, some sort of a diesel generator here. So if your water system went down, like in the winter or sometime like that, where you need power, uh, that diesel generator could be fired up and produce electricity. I'm not sure how those uh, valves operated or what they're for, but uh, there's one on each pipe I see. One over there too for that pipe. How they work with the gate valves, I'm not quite sure, but it might be. Could be. Not sure. Anyway, that's uh, an overview of uh, how to produce electricity in a big way. After that uh, other valve there with that small pipe leading from there, going through the wall, and uh, comes right around here and goes into another water wheel. I'll step to the other side of that pipe. I think the light will be better over there. Okay, that's a little better. That's a small pelting wheel. Probably 16 inches in diameter in there or less. And, uh, Said with one nozzle underneath. But what's going on here is that water wheel is powering, I would say, a high pressure water pump. This is pumping water up to an organization, it's a health spa actually, that's uh, up the mountain here quite a ways. They use a lot of the electricity that's produced in this plant. And through donations from them, this was uh, the whole power plant was made a possibility. So we get, get water up a thousand feet or whatever it is up there. You have to use some sort of a piston pump. As far as I know, this has been operating continuously too for 40, 40 plus years. So if you have water pressure and lots of water, you can do just about anything. So I hope you found these uh, videos interesting. Thank you for watching and uh, ask you to subscribe to my channel. There's lots of uh, other things that uh, were done on this farm that's, uh, that's interesting as well.